Hey guys, welcome back to B Games, and today we'll be covering chimps in covered gardens. Now, this is an annoying map because you can't really place stuff inside because the things, the tiles, the windows, or whatever you call them, they keep moving. So let's start with Sada right there. Just shove it in that upper, that bend right there. And that should be a good start. And you can switch auto start on for now because it's pretty easy. So what we're trying to do this time is basically put all the towers outside of these windows. So except for the hero. Okay, sorry about that. Except for the hero, we're going to put all the stuff outside the window. So basically on the upper left side. So we start with the dark monkey right there. We keep him on strong so that he gets, uh, he pops the blues and the greens and then it makes it easier for Sada. Keep an eye for any leaks. If so, you can use Sada's ability. Okay, and then we will put in a druid. Druid in it is an excellent start in any chimps game. So here we have the druid coming up and we're going to upgrade him first to 200 two, two okay so we're going to try to upgrade him to 200 because the lightning will take care of all the uh, stronger balloons right they, it'll make them weaker like green will pop to blue and then uh, that'll make them weaker for soda to take care of them easily as soda is just level one or two or whatever right he's quite weak right now or she actually <laughs> okay so we're gonna put all our towers except for sada in the outside corner so i'll see you when we have so in this do you see that the balloon just ex es escaped so i have to use my ability so 14 and 15 are the only two challenging rounds once you have the lightning of the druid and uh, you keep on going and then you can upgrade the druid to 230 and then we're gonna leave him there on first for a while, okay? I'll see you when we get the heli pilot, okay? That's the next tower, basically. So see ya. Okay, so we have just enough to get a heli, so we're going to put him right above the druid. So we're going to actually get two helis in this uh, run. One on, uh, what is that, Apache Prime, we're going to upgrade this guy to basically a Apache Prime eventually. And the other one we're going to get to 205, the bottom path, okay? So two helis, one to slow down all the balloons and the BFBs and the B, uh, Moabs, right? And the other one to just destroy them, and that's Apache Prime. He's our main, main damage dealer, apart from Sada in early game. Okay, so we're going to upgrade this guy to 202. We will be getting a village to get camo detection on our helis. So both helis will not be able to detect camo until round 40. It's basically, or somewhere around, around 40, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, what is that? Uh, Sada will take care of all the chemo till round 40. Okay, so we have the other heli up and running. And we're going to upgrade this guy before round 40 to 203. Okay? And then we're going to up upgrade the Apache Prime. Right? Or Apache Dart ship first. Yeah. Okay. So here we are. And that's about it. So I'll see you on round 40. 
Okay, so we're almost at round 40. One of the helis is going to slow down the MOAB and the other one's going to pop it, right? So here we are. And there we have the MOAB. And it's popped, right? Sada just took care of barely like one or two balloons. So it's a perfect strategy. One slowing down, the other one uh, going for the kill. Okay, now we are getting a village because we have, remember, we have no Kema except for Sada. So here we have a village. We are going to upgrade the village for 0 2 first. 0 2 0 that is. And then 2 2. So we have 2 2 0 village. We have the. Uh, what is this called? The heli. And we're going for the top path of the heli, for the bottom heli right we will get a uh, what is that another uh, tower that's about it in this game and that tower would be obviously the alchemist okay so uh yeah we're not going to wait uh so yeah the druid we need to upgrade the druid so we're gonna upgrade the druid first because uh, for round 63, that's the dreaded round, right? Like, everyone hates that round. So, uh, round 63, we need a druid at 2, 4, 0. That is druid of the jungle, right? Uh, we will not be getting spirit of the forest, my favorite tower in this game. We will not be getting that tower. We're just getting the two uh, helis maxed out. And that should take care of all the balloons, okay? So, we got the druid, and now we're going for the top heli for the bottom path, right? We need to get that to 2, 3. So, here we have it. We have it available, but we're not getting it, just to show you. So, in the meantime, yeah, we don't need to get it immediately, okay? You can get it whenever you... Basically, it's a pretty easy strategy, right? So, you can get it whenever you want. Okay, I'll see you when we get it, and I'll see you in round 63, basically. Okay, so we're almost at round 63, and we'll have uh, money for Apache Dark Ship right at round 63 right, right in the middle of down round 63 but we're not gonna get it are we? Did we ever find it? I think we did yeah no we didn't okay so yeah you don't really need Apache Dark Ship to beat round 63 as you can see okay so you can get round 6 uh, you can get Apache Dark Ship whenever you have it available okay uh, it should be this is a pretty easy strategy uh, you can employ this strategy in any of the early game maps like beginner or in intermediate as well some of the advanced maps uh, this strategy works too yeah so it's a pretty nice strategy okay so we want to get uh, probably i'm just i'm just showing you that we have enough cash and uh, we don't we have enough killing power basically destroying power right we have enough destroying power to uh mm, i don't think you can use the cable on uh, youtube i'm not sure okay whatever so we can basically uh destroy these uh, balloons uh till round 70 74 is when you might die so i probably get, will get it around round 71 okay or 70 uh, that is Apache Dark Ship, and then we're just gonna save up for Apache Prime, okay? So I'll see you then. So once you get Apache Dark Ship uh, in the middle, somewhere before round 78 or 76, you wanna get. Uh, uh, what is that alchemist and upgraded to three zero uh three two zero I think? no three zero one okay three zero one yeah 
Uh, so after this, uh, you can leave an update to 3D, 320, it doesn't really matter. So in this one, I basically forgot to upgrade the alchemist to 40 and 401, right? And I, I think I died. Yeah, I did die in uh, later rounds. So I'll include that. So make sure you eventually upgrade the what is this alchemist whenever you can uh to four not just three don't just leave him like i did at three uh upgrade him to four zero one or four two zero okay it's up to you i will see you when basically i'll see you be when we have enough for apache prime Okay, so we have enough for the Apache Prime, and we're gonna get it, and uh, that's around round 85, I think we get, or 84 ending, okay, and then I do upgrade my Alchemist to uh, 4, which I did forget, but it's not because of the Alchemist, I die in round 94 or 95 because of, uh, uh, I forgot to upgrade my uh, village, so I'll be upgrading. Uh, uh, you'll see me down eventually. Um, so I'll include that. So if you don't, so next you should upgrade your village to two three zero. The third tier of the village, that is the middle tier, is the third one. I don't know what it's called. Uh, it's like six thousand or seven thousand. That's really good against GDTs. It makes all your towers in the radius stronger. To basically get any uh, DDTs, yeah, it's really good. You should always try to get that in uh, what is this? Uh, chimps, okay. So, I'll see you then. I'll see you basically at the very end when we have enough uh, to get our heli pilot to round uh, what is that to 205, okay. See ya. Okay, so we just got our, what is that, 205 heli, and now we're gonna get another alchemist just to boost him up too, okay? We don't really need him, but might as well get him. So we'll get this alchemist to two, what is this, four, zero, 420, and that's about it. It's an easy strategy. We do try to, I do try to um, include a... Uh, what is that? A spike factory at the very end, uh, towards round 100. But it's, uh, you don't really need it. I try to get a spike factory, I try to upgrade it to, what is that? Spike stone, but I don't really get it. So, yeah, yeah, as you can see, it's pretty easy. All the towers, uh, all the, what is that? Levels do get destroyed. You know, 98, 99. The, piece of cake and uh, that's about it so do use the strategy on any of the maps actually uh, any of the beginner or uh, uh, that? beginner or intermediate maps it does work in very few advanced maps okay so as you can see i'm trying to get the spike factory and i do fail miserably to get the spike storm <laughs> but whatever you don't really need it okay so thank you for watching and uh, don't forget to hit that like button okay this is b games signing off guys and i will see you another one take care